The Nebraska Humane Society is putting out a call for help. Dog kennels there are at capacity, but there are ways to help even if you can't commit long term. Aaron Hagerty is in the newsroom with the story. Aaron? Molly, NHS says for dogs, they're full now, but doing what they can. Plus, they are concerned about what will happen when it gets warmer when they tend to get even more dogs in. But they're already seeing people answering their call for help by offering to foster. It's the first thing you'll see on the NHS website, a pop-up saying, emergency fosters needed. We are literally out of kennel space. Just about every kennel is full, so that means that if they're strays, they have to get creative to make room. And every day there are, you know, from five to 15 strays that come into the shelter. And we have to have room for those dogs to continually come into the shelter because that's our role in the community. Pam Weiss with the Humane Society says adoptions are down and other rescue groups are full too. Right now, nobody has room for transfer. I mean, we are working as hard as we can to try to find places for animals to go and just about everybody's in the same boat. There are 274 dog kennels here at NHS, 270 dogs here right now. Not all of them are available for adoption, but Hershey is one of 150 that are. Pam says that's the most dogs available for adoption she's seen in her 20 years working here. Maybe you can't commit to adopting. Foster homes are needed too. To foster, just take the survey on their website. NHS will help match you with a dog depending on what's appropriate for your situation. You don't necessarily need a fenced-in yard or any yard at all. Plus, they'll provide food and other supplies. So why should people foster? We asked someone doing it. It's a lot of fun. It really is. It's a temporary dog. <laughs> She's agreeing. <laughs> Marissa Myers has fostered Blue Diamond for three months now. No one's applied to adopt her yet. Fostering has advantages. It can reveal what dogs are like outside the shelter. Like Blue was really stressed out in the shelter. She was, she was depressed and sleeping all the time. And um, here she's playful and happy. It brings so much joy to your home. It's so much fun finding out the personalities and quirks of each dog. It's kind of like a test drive too, especially for people that maybe haven't gotten a dog on their own or um, not sure if a dog fits into their lifestyle. And Pam with the Humane Society told me the economy might be a reason why adoptions are down. Plus, they're seeing people emergency relinquish animals they can't afford uh, anymore and an increase in pet food pantry use. All that said, it's worth reiterating that NHS says they'll give you the supplies you need to foster. In the newsroom, Aaron Hagerty, 3 News Now.